Howdy cowdies. Aloha. All that sort of jazz. How's it going? Hope you're all right. Weekly walkabout time. We've got heaps of cool stuff. I've been busy this week. Nice little uh, 18 karat gold watch there with the fob chain and everything on it. It's got all different coloured gold around the face. And a nice little thing. Little 10 karat gold fob watch over the back as well. A little Moran and Kato's little sample tea tins of cracker. What's that? The West Oven Squares tobacco tins nice over the back as well. Cool little deco cigarette lighter with a cigar cutter. Nice old bottle opener. This little Vesta there with advertising on the back. A little silver sort of cauldron with the three feet. It's a cute little bit. Nice little Art Nouveau silver matchbox cover. Some Eastern silver aminals over the back. A nice little, little plane there. A little violin plane or something like that. Cool little pair of pliers. Good for your nose hairs. A little watch key there from Dunklings. So lots of nice stuff. Some sterling silver gold plated pocket watches. What else have we got? Some little tribal carvings. Smart watch over the back there. Heaps of casino chips. Some fantastic hard rock cafe guitar brooches and badges. Some nice little, it's a lovely little bracelet in there with all enameled um, card suits with a nice little silver charm bracelet. Christoffel. Nice little bits of deco sort of enameled there. So nice couple of little tins of clock oil. So lots of nice little bits in the jewellery cabinet this week. What else have we got? This is cool. A laurel kerosene drum there with a nice old bung on the front. Little chippy style cabinet. Just needs some shelves. Not hard to find. Nice little pair of chairs with a lovely sort of shaped wooden arms. Cool little lamp with a scrolly base. What not. Meat safe. I like this. We're not worth a hell of a lot, but it's just ace. The Clark Pools ladder to go on the outside of your old in-ground or above-ground pool. What have we got in here? Horse harness and keys and stuff. We've got some cool clothes. Nice old gents dinner suit there. Levi's denim jacket. Some waistcoats and sort of Hawaiian and summer shirts and ladies' fur and woolen coats. Boxes of glassware and stuff. Another box of pottery and china and all sorts of gear. Some rock specimens and things. Pretty china. These are all sort of car radios and Avon bottles. Chopper chub tins and stuff. Some Sherwood stereo gear. Got some nice Onkyo stereo gear here. Box lots. Heaps of military camouflage, military stuff. Cool old ammo crate. Yeah, so we've got toolbox and contents. Pretty cool. Heaps of stuff in there. Nice old planet lamp there or something. Needs a little bit of work, but it's pretty cool. Boxes of china. What else have we got? Ladders. Dolls. Mixed boxes of stuff. Nice big lot of tools. Toys. Cool old boat anchor or typewriter. Old sort of phones. What else have we got? Some cool sort of tripod model lamps. Some good golf clubs. Tailor-made irons and a ping wood and a big Brosnan blockhead wood. Nice old leather suitcases, these are nice little sort of wooden drawers, boxes of books and games, more tools, china and silver plate and stuff, old cuckoo clock in there, what else have we got, fire screens and lead light windows and mannequins and dummies, they look like they're kind of having a bit of fun down in the corner, I like that little sort of plastic woven plastic little sort of laundry baskets, cute. Some wallpaper sample book there and some rolls of wallpaper. Now, so we've got all the pictorial social study books. Cool old gents' ties and a waistcoat. Big cash book. It was full of cash when it turned up. <laughs> Banana lounges are cool old retro ones. Another nice little drawer set. More sort of industrial drawers. Some cool old bottles and stuff. Old Bovril packing crate in there as well. Nice big military sort of cane trunk there. Another one that's a little bit damaged. It's had borer through it, so we've put it with a nice old fire curb. What else have we got? Pool and snooker balls, lamps and lighting down the bottom there. Weights and stuff, die cast toys, cutlery sets, little red phone, big lot of sort of M&M stuff. Glass and pottery. Violins. What's some nice paintings this week? What have we got? A nice little Bronowski colour litho there of some owls. It's a nice Ron Carter green watercolour there of a country house, house or homestead. 
Now, so we've got signed cricket. There you go. All signed by all the Australian teams. Shane Warne, Gilchrist, Punter, Steve Waugh, Glenn McGrath. This is fantastic as well. The Robert Young watercolour. And there's Trouble Afoot at the Hormone Inn. Typical example of his work. Fantastic, good fun, real Australian. Great thing. What else have we got in the way of pictures? We've got some good stuff. Nice little Ronald Miller. 1953 early. Lovely Louis Kahan. Little nude study there. And another nice little Louis Kahan of a couple of girls. Or boys. <laughs> uh, what else have we got? Nice little Aboriginal painting. All the details in the back, which is nice. This is nice. The Gunnar Crummins. It's one of the Latvian blue brush artists. Bushfire. And this is an interesting bit. By Arnold Crummins. Latvian artist, but can't find much um, reference to him. It's dated 1949 and signed lower right. It's painted over in Latvia. It's a nice impressionistic thing. It's quite nice. I really like the frame around it. Nice colours. Good thing. What else have we got? Headphones, footy cards, watercolours of boats, M&M dudes, old footy cards here, plus Darren Pritchard without a mullet. I don't know about that. M&M stuff, headphones, good retro china, Arabia and Spode, good lot of glass, lovely blue and white oriental pieces up the top there. A little Kodak camera in its case, some good records, the doors, the Rolling Stones and, wait for it, Pussycat, first of all. Huh? Look at that kid there. And that guy is pretty happy with himself. <laughs> His record covers are fantastic. And also we've got some nice little boomerangs, a little bit of Italian over the back there. Cool old Valvoline oil tin that someone's used another spout and stuck on top. Nice little Frederick George Reynolds watercolour. George Phillips oil painting there is nice. Nice little poniot. Some old sort of military helmets. A couple of interesting paintings. Water bottles, nice big crocodilly. Yes, we've got big lot of Metallica gear. The box set's pretty cool. Live ship binge and purge. It's all complete with the with the original VHS videos. Nice lot of glass, some snowballs, good old Costa. Yes, we've got retro gear, more glass, nice big Japanese export, nice bits of rouge, nice lot of Australian pottery. He's a cute little bit of Charlie Wilton. Yeah, nice old ammo crate, some brass tools and stuff, telescopic sights, petrol pump nozzle, cool old phones, and a nice lot of blokey gear. Like the old lock there with some other little bits as well in a box, some good records and a reel-to-reel -reel master's apprentice tape, tins, padlocks, nice little paper spikes there, receipt sort of holders. Here's a little um, hone up melodica there, little sort of keyboard, little wind instrument keyboard. Little tribal Aboriginal bits, padlocks and keys, Australian pottery, a couple of cool old, old board games, signed Alan Border, playing a bit of a hook shot. And we've got a couple of cabinets, nice lots of china, more china, nice Hoff violin, a pair of lovely watercolours over the back there, the nice bits of glass, big sort of smoke glass bowls, a bit unusual, French sort of starburst. Sunburst tray over the back, a couple of bits of Silvac, some in unusual WMF, a nice bit of Bendigo, this is a funny little bit, this car thing, got a lift up lid with little sort of trays and stuff inside, it's possibly a little paint box, some nice bits of sort of 80s designer Rosenthal, German porcelain, bloody good quality stuff that. Also got an interesting little bit of Australian pottery there, the teapot, some more nice blue and white, Victorian glass luster. A little pl original plaque, a little bit of carnival glass, and in the end cabinet we're looking pretty cool. We've got some lovely stuff, an old military flare pistol holster, this is some weird steam engine tester or something, nice big reproduction bronze, some, this is quite nice, old sort of oriental tapestry there with all the sort of metallic thread work, it's got a fair bit of age to it, nice thing. Really like this, the big sort of heavy brass Hudson, Lockheed Hudson aeroplane. Lovely old door knocker. Beautiful big 1930s sort of hand-painted crocus tea set, dinner set, whatever you want. Little carved soapstone, some Aboriginal bits, tack hacks and a brownie downing. Nice big Royal Albert chintz set. Fantastic little reference reference book, illustrated catalogue on old keys. Lovely old pyramid phone, some sterling silver frames. 
Uh, top shelf, we've got some nice bits. Lovely bigger Wudgy pottery vase over the back. Little Beswick or Dalton horse, I think. Lovely bit of Italian glass. Another nice bit of a Wudgy, the green one, and the blue one is a Wudgy Japanese as well. What else have we got? Nice little bit of Australian pottery. It's unmarked. The Australian carnival glass with the kookaburra. That's a nice bit. 1937 Judith Miles Australian pottery lamp base. Really lovely thing. Anyway, there's heaps more stuff. More stuff over in these cabinets as well. Jewellery and tribal and postcards and great old bumper stickers. Wrestling gear. Fob watches. Cool little lot of tins. Plum bobs. Yeah. That'll sort of do. Hopefully you saw something you like, guys. See you on Thursday night. It's only a small sale this week. 330 lots, so we won't be too long on Thursday night. See yous.